It's Friday the 13th, which means superstitious people everywhere are hoping they don't come across any bad luck. Yeah, but for tattoo lovers, it's a good luck tradition. KCAL News reporter Rita Nakano explains. Artists are hard at work, poking pigment into skin, creating beautiful designs made just for Friday the 13th. Weeks leading up to Friday the 13th, we'll make brand new flash sheets of fun designs that we want to tattoo. For years, Port City Tattoo in Long Beach has been offering special designs at discounted prices. The tradition began at a parlor in Texas in the mid-90s, and it's now a nationwide phenomenon. Getting tattoo on Friday the 13th. To celebrate, Brian Corral is getting a flaming heart with a 13 on it. I like to personally go to different shops on Friday the 13th because I just love to support the industry and different artists. Manager Taylor Pescada says on a normal Friday, there will be about 10 customers. But on Friday the 13th, the waiting rooms are always full, often with repeat customers. If you have lots of ink, chances are at least one of them is a Friday the 13th tattoo. I do have one right here. It's an old uh, Sailor Jerry design. Once I got my first Friday 13 tattoo, it oddly became a tradition. You know, I have about well, getting my fourth one done right now. So why is Friday the 13th such a big deal in the tattoo industry? Well, legend says that sailors often got the number 13 tattooed on them so that when bad luck saw it, it would pass on by. So while everyone else is cautiously waiting for the notorious unlucky day to end, ink lovers say they can't get enough of it. For us, it just kind of turned into like a good luck, something fun to do. In Long Beach, I'm Rena Nakano. Extra special today. <laughs> KCAL News.